Today we are going to see how we can create this double exposure effect in Photoshop. So let's start. We are going to recreate this double exposure. Now go to File and click on New, then create a new document. Here I'm taking 1000 by 1000 pixel. Now hit Create. Now drag and drop the base picture. Increase the size if you need. Position in the middle. Now select Quick Selection Tool and hit on Select Subject. The subject will be selected automatically. Otherwise, you can use any tool to select subject. Press Ctrl J to make a copy of it in a new layer. Now bring the second image. Adjust the size if you need. Now decrease the opacity of it and adjust the position. Change blending mode to screen. Hit enter. Now right click and clipping mask it. Select the clipping image, then hit on mask. Now take brush tool, choose soft round brush. Change foreground color to black. Now paint like this. Follow the process carefully. Now press Ctrl J to make a copy of the image. Delete the mask. Change blending mode to multiply. Decrease the opacity. Now click on mask. Again, use the soft round brush like before, mask the half of the image. Now select the clipping image and increase the opacity to 100. Now select the subject layer, take hue and saturation, now decrease the saturation a little bit. Now take a new layer above all, take Gradient Tool and choose Black to Transparent Gradient. Apply on the bottom of the layer like this. Now it's time to bring another image. I'm taking this bird image. Decrease the size and place it like this. Now it's time to bring the text which I have already created. Just drag the text and place it. Now select both texts, press Ctrl A to select all. Select Move tool and align in the middle. Press Ctrl D to deselect. Our project is ready. This is our final product. If you like the video, hit the like button and share with your friends. 
If you are not subscribed, please do it for future uploads. See you soon.